What is going on, everybody? This is BH Theory. Welcome to Six Nights at Zany Club. Um, now, this is a fan game made by Tony. Again, he's this. He is the same one that. Um, well, <laughs> okay, mess up my words. Okay, so this is made. This is another fan-made game about Tony G. Bud, made, made by Tony, who also made Five Zany Nights. I, I haven't. I haven't played that game at all. I'm sorry, but yeah, but this is a new one and we were given early access to it uh, So this is being recorded before it's publicly announced and there may be a trailer with all our videos But that's not the point yet. So I'm really excited because I have no idea what to expect in this Like I om I know like nothing like like Ryan and Tony have kept this like a secret for God knows how long like for like a year now and it's so secret. The only thing I do know is that I believe there's 10 characters in this. But other than that, I have no idea what to expect. I don't know what. What the heck? Oh, there it is. Something on. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it doesn't matter. But anyway, it's supposed to get a new game. I'm just. Yeah, I'm just excited. Alright. Ryan Friends City Club. Upcoming family restaurant. Looking for security guard work. The night shift at 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. I have to work eight hours. Monitor cameras. Ensure safety equipment. And amateur characters. $500 a week. What? That's a steal. But, uh... Jeez, we have to work eight hours? That's... That's right, yeah. Eight hours. Okay. God, I can barely survive six. <laughs> Alright. So. Oh, my God. I'm really... Like... I'm wondering what the heck are we gonna see? Okay. Come on. It's taking, it's taking a while. Oh, there we go. What the heck? All right. Oh, yeah. He said that the office will be... Oh, no. What's this going to be? He said the office isn't really the greatest, so... Oh, here's everyone. Okay. There's John 2, Rai, FNAF fan, and... Is that Hello. Andrew? Hello. Hey, this is Aaron, or you can call me AJ. Anyway, oh, my God. AJ is the I'm one sure voicing? You're probably wondering why we oh, there's Dark you Bot. for the night guard position, because, one, all the you're masks. the best candidate we got. Second, we desperately need a night guard. Fox Here's the reason. Wish there was names on like camera so I see. Someone broke into the establishment and tampered with the animatronics. The reason oh we know this hey, is so because we know this the security oh, no. cameras of a person tampering and we don't oh, know okay, a so lot that's of people how you see that actually had the knowledge of the animatronics or the knowledge of the company. And that's when we concluded it was an old friend of ours, Richard Viperson, which we have previously cut ties with. It's a shame. We were once good friends of him. Who the heck was we trusted the heck him, told and you already? he seemed to be a very friendly and trustworthy person. But during the advertisement, he did a very scummy move. He attempted to claim that the company was his. First, Rebecca found out, and as a result, we had to cut the advertisement, redo it, and then basically tell him to back off. The reasons were just plain jealousy of Rye and all that. I was the one that told him to back off. And after that, he completely turned against us and stabbed us in the back to try to seek revenge. He's been trying to ruin our reputation ever since. Right now, the police are involved in this. Man, it's not very good. I personally cannot believe he did this. I thought he was very trustworthy. I guess I was so wrong. weird hearing. It's so weird hearing AJ anyway, talk in this game. Enough about him. Here's what's supposed to happen. The characters were supposed to be friendly. Like Rai is supposed to be the energetic leader. My character is supposed to be the kind of the goofy guy. Including Rebecca, Bailey, and the other characters involved. They're supposed to be representative of us. They were supposed to catch in in case a burglar breaks in. Unfortunately, ever since the break-in, they see anybody as an intruder, including you. So here's what you can do. Check the cameras, there's a power switch in the office that you can use, and if the animatronic comes close, turn it off. You won't be able to see the animatronic, but they won't be able to see you. Everything is going to be okay. Now, I want to say this, Six, thank seven. you very much for not only offering to help, Eight, but for also supporting us. 
Oh, way. whoa, 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 whoa. The best. What's that? Yeah. Have a good night oh. And good luck. Oh, that's what that does. Okay, so... I, I wasn't paying attention at all. So there's... So the only way these guys can really get in is through my vents. And I don't know if that's really all. I really should have paid attention. Oh, God. I think I start moving. Oh, no! John, why are you moving? They're both moving! Wait, hold on. I have a question. If I... Seal a vent. Okay, no. I was going to be like... Wait. I, I don't know. So they can only get through these two vents. Wait, there's a third vent. Wait, there's one. Shoot, where the heck is John? Oh god, this is gonna be. Oh god, I'm so creeped out. So. If I remember, yeah, there was ten. So there's supposed to be ten characters. I've only counted nine. I don't know who the ninth one is. Uh, he's gone. Oh my god. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, hold on. I gotta do a count. One. I think that counts as one. This is where synapse comes from. I'm pretty sure. One. Two. Crap. Reset that. The cat. Oh, I got it. So could be Okay, he's right there. I swear, I almost thought one of them was going Shoot. Wait, what do I do? Do I close that door? Oh! So I can turn off the light. Do I do that? Oh shoot, he's gonna go in that vent. So I gotta watch that one. Wait, what, oh, I thought, I swear, <laughs> I thought one of them began to move. Oh, he's in there. Wait. <gasps> oh, okay, good, that's how it works. Okay, so he's not in there. Wait, does he go back to the stage? Yeah, he does. So I gotta watch that door now. Okay, so I get it now. So I turn off the power when they're at the door. Stop, okay. So far, yeah, this is really cool looking. No, stop! <laughs> what was going on? Okay, good. He's gone. Stop. It's very... Okay, that's something... Okay, so... If... I can make a tiny complaint... I ha I will have to say that... It's kind of... The, the, the camera thing is extremely sensitive. I will say that. That's the only thing... Yeah, it's extremely sensitive. So, like... Like... Like the simplest movement and it'll just go back up that's my only concern though but oh, everything else is like just amazing so where the heck this thing is so confusing because like okay i'm not trying to be mad at all because the sign makes it seem like it's supposed to be that's the main stage area but it's not this is an when you think that this is supposed to be... Oh crap, he moved. He's in the hall again. So where is... He's right there. 
Yeah, that's the only confusing part. <laughs> Good work, sport. <laughs> oh no, night two. Oh no. So now, I'm assuming these guys are gonna get active now. I nearly died on the first night. Uh, hello? Hey man, it's me, Rye. Are you okay? Okay, good. Yeah, I was honestly quite worried for you because there's actually something that Aaron forgot to tell you last night. Um, I'm pretty sure he told you that if an animatronic tries to get into your office, then you would turn off the power so that they can't see you. Well, that actually won't work if an animatronic tries to crawl through one of the vents. Because once they're in the vent, they can basically hear everything that's going on in your office. And since their systems have been tampered with where they see anybody as an intruder, they'll basically try to get into your office even if the power's off. However, you don't need to panic because there's an easy way to defend yourself from that. Um, if an animatronic does happen to crawl into a vent, then what you need to do is go to the vent cameras and double click on that camera to seal that vent. That way the animatronic will not be able to get into your office. However, there is two, a minor it? downside to that. These vent doors are a little dumb because number one, you can only close one vent at a time. And number two, they actually open automatically after a while because we need to conserve power and we need to Wait, keep the air does. flowing in the building because as you probably already noticed, we already have a ventilation problem where it has to be reset every once in a while. Uh, but don't worry, as long as you pay close attention to those things, you should have nothing to worry about. Sort of. Nothing to worry about, oh, fix your- you have a question? Oh yeah, that withered animatronic in the back room. Yeah, he was supposed to be Logan, also known as Sylvester Bot. And he was going to be an animatronic in this establishment as well. But unfortunately, the manufacturers messed up when they were building him. They got his color wrong, and they gave him these really freaky eyes. So we didn't think he looked very family friendly at all. So instead, he's supposed to be a security animatronic, <gasps> and we just call him oh, no. <laughs> Okay, now, she's going to go in that room, definitely. I'm not sure if he's been tampered with or not. So he may or may not. I hope activate. not. Hopefully he doesn't. So I'm pay attention to keeping an eye on him rooms. just in case, though. Wait, so uh, really anyways, I do have to get going okay. now. Andrew's so right here. I wish you good luck. Stay safe, and thank you again for helping us out. We all really appreciate it. All right, Thanks. have a good night, man, and we'll hopefully talk to you tomorrow. Hopefully, hopefully. <laughs> what kind of establishment are you running? Who makes it so they have to reset your building, uh, reset your air every once in a while? Who does that? I'm not trying to... <laughs> okay, you guys are probably going to get mad at me like, what? So... Oh no, she's going to go through that. Is there going to be a sound playing when she's in the vent? Where the heck did he go? Oh, okay, good. He's right there. <laughs> Scared the... Oh no! I see you, dragon. Don't try it. Don't you do that. 
I don't know what I'm saying. I'm, fine. I'm sorry. So yeah, she's coming through this vent. Oh, well, what? I locked that. There. So now. Down tubes right there. I'm kind of glad I clicked on that. So I don't really know what else to say. This does. This definitely has gotten down the uh, tense feeling. Oh, she out. She get out. Yeah. Okay. Good. What does Sean do? Shoot, he's in the hallway now. It has the exact same tense feeling of what the original Five Nights at Freddy's was. And the thing is now about Five Nights at Freddy's is it's not as scary as what it used to be anymore, but you can't deny it still has that tense feeling of I do not want to die. With these things all over the place so much, you ha it's like the panicking feeling. That's what really makes it scary now. It's not all oh, the jump scares anymore. I mean, they do s <laughs> scary now. It's a tense feeling like, oh shoot, I gotta do this. But I also gotta do this at the same time. Oh shoot, she's back in there. Oh. The heck is Andrew? She's right there. So yeah. Oh no! Don't tell me he's gonna kill me. Is he? Is he like Foxy in this game and then I have to watch him? Is that even. Just realizing now, is that even Andrew? Because. No, that has to be Andrew, I think. Is it? Andrew's back there. What are you doing in there? I didn't even realize he was in there. So where is she? Oh, shit. No, no, no. All right, I'm sorry if I'm being obnoxious. <laughs> Whatever, I don't care. I don't know why I bother going back to the office. Because no one's there. Shoot, where did John Tube go? Yeah, but they nailed properly the um, tense feeling. If I could, I don't. I don't like saying this stuff because I don't want to. Because I know you guys worked really hard on this. If I had to make a suggestion, I feel like it would be better to spread out, make the AI a little bit more different. Okay. Make the AI a little different because in the original game, you don't know where they're gonna be next. But in this one, you can kind of tell. Okay, he's right there. He's gonna go to this room next. There's something like that. I don't know. All right, we'll play this. We'll just try and see how far we can get. Alright, if I die in this night. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, <laughs> He's gonna be on the phone now. Hello? Oh, hey, you made it to night three. Great job! Anyway. My name is Holly, and I'm one of the co-workers here oh, at the Holly. Penny Club. So, I suggest you keep a close eye on things, because I'm a little bit worried that the animatronic may become more active than usual. Let's just say, where we are today... Oh no, she's moving now. incident with one of them. You know that oh, now I have a music box? box? That was the well, earlier today, she randomly activated out of nowhere. She started walking slowly 
towards one of our other co-workers and started to make really strange noises. It was almost like she was trying to send a message to him or something, but we no, they're both moving. she was trying to threaten him or call for help. It was really strange. God, are they all moving now? Yeah, it was Where the heck is she even going? I really hope the animatronics get fixed soon. Oh, and one more thing. Be sure to keep an eye on the music box in the party room on Cam Night. Make sure it stays smelled up at all times. It'll help keep one of the animatronics away. Got it? Okay, good. Anyway, I better go now. So, I hope you have a good night and we'll talk to you tomorrow. See ya! I really hope that... Okay, she's going in there. I really hope I could just easily stay on this camera. Because, like, I could easily, like, when they're in the room, easily just press the button. But I don't know if, like, any of these guys... I don't know if, like, her or something, like, runs or anything. I don't know if this is going to be like Five Nights at Candy's where some of these characters you don't know. No! Power! Why, why did everything seem dark? So I'm assuming since FNAF and was like in the room, it's gonna be. Oh no, now he's going in the vent. Where's Bailey? Okay. Shit. God, now this is even more horrifying. laying down the strategy here. <laughs> going in the vent. Oh. 
Okay, I'm on. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, well, I don't know what I was doing wrong. I think I was supposed to watch him and I wasn't. I wasn't paying attention. I thought it was just one of those things where I could easily just... I, I had to stay on that camera. I thought he was going to be another one. I don't know. That, that freaking scared me. But, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, that's that. Uh, I might play more. Maybe when the full game comes out, I'll try and finish it. But anyways, yeah, that's Six Nights at Zany Club. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.